Hi, my name is Barry Bowling. I am an application engineer with Yokogawa's Test and Measurement Division. Today I'm going to demonstrate how simple it is to make not only voltage and current measurements from a single phase feed such as the one behind me in the breaker panel, but also in real time make power calculations using a recorder. In this case, the Yokogawa DL850 scope quarter. I'm currently connected to a single phase supply. The nominal voltage is 480 volts. It is wired as a two wire system and I'm making a line-to-line -line voltage measurement and a single phase current measurement. Behind me in the breaker panel are my connections. For the voltage measurement, I am wired directly into the DL850 scope quarter. For the current measurement, I am using a clamp on CT. Assisting today is Rachel Hill. Rachel, thank you for helping out today. The load on my supply is a TIG welder, which sees only intermittent usage, meaning that it is a very dynamic load. While I am recording in real time voltage and current waveforms, I'm also displaying only the RMS voltage, RMS current, the power in watts, apparent power in volt amps, reactive power, power factor, and watt hours. I will make these measurements while the welder is operating as Rachel welds for approximately 20 or 25 seconds. At rest, the welder is consuming approximately 450 watts and 8,700 volt amps. The power factor at rest is approximately 0.1 or less. My very next step while Rachel is welding is to take each of these measurements at the input of the power supply of the welder and display them on the screen of the DL850. Okay, Rachel will do the welding and I will start the recorder. So Rachel, are you ready? Okay, let's do some welding. Here are my test results uh, from the, the welder measurements. As you can see, I have measured a number of things here. Uh, my power during that welding session was uh, 7.2 kilowatts uh, maximum, and then uh, my watt hours uh, is 19.85 watt hours for about 20 seconds worth of the welding session. Um, my apparent power on average was 11.5 uh, kilovolt amps. And uh, lambda bounces around a lot, but I averaged it here, and it's 0 0.2347. RMS voltage, 483 volts. RMS current, um, 24.5 amps. Uh, so those look like pretty good numbers and uh, good results on that test. What is happening simultaneously, even though I do not have these measurements displayed on the screen at the moment, is that I am also measuring 125 other power parameters and 123 additional harmonic current parameters all at the same time in real time. I can view any of these measurements on the screen or save them to a binary file and view them and study them later on my PC. Traditionally, oscilloscopes and recorders have not been used to make power and harmonic measurements, but now, as you can see, the DL850 scope quarter has new capabilities and new applications such as real-time power measurements, which I have demonstrated today.